Hey guys, Jason here, and just wanted to talk to you just a little bit about what it's like to be set apart. Sometimes we uh, have our focus just a little bit different, but I wanted to use a really awkward demonstration of what it is to be set apart. You see, when we have Jesus and Jesus' blood um, shed on the cross, not just for a few people, but for all, um, you know, sometimes we like to look at each other as individuals. Um, ourselves included as as individuals, but God's pretty clear that we're all called to be His, to be covered by the same blood uh, that was shed on the cross. Uh, but regardless, let's just take a minute and just look at self. So let's just say each one of these numbers represents one of us, maybe you, um, you know, maybe this six of hearts is me, maybe this ten of diamonds is you, maybe the uh, the six of spades, whatever your uh, your favorite card is there. But let's just say that this is you. So we'll take you, for instance. Now, if we're Christians, we're called to be set apart, to be different, to be uh, a new creation. And, and people are supposed to be able to tell by the way that we act, not by the, the books that we say that we read, the music that we say that we listen to, not by the worship that we appear to give on Sundays, but by the way that we act seven days a week, 24 hours a day. So if we're truly called out to be Christians, we should be different. We should be set apart. But you see, here's what happens to the whole world. We take the whole world and, and, and we have, you know, some that are showing their worldliness and some that show God. And, you know, it kind of gets split, split right in half. So we take and split the world right in half to where we have some that are showing God's love and then we have some that are showing themselves and the world gets mixed up and we get ready to be tossed in this crazy world but the world's a little bit more mixed up than just that because you see we're tossed into this big huge melting pot of a world where everything is jarbled up sometimes we don't know which way is up which way's down? So we immerse ourselves in this world. And we get put in and caught into this world. But God says that we're to be a new creation, a new creature. That we're supposed to be a light that's cast out to be something totally different. And while we may see individuals and we may see Christians... And we may all be covered by Christ's blood. We should really be sticking out like a sore thumb. Saying, you know what? My actions are something different. My actions are different of this world. They're not of this world. Because he who I follow isn't of this world. So that's why we need to stand out. And be something totally different. Because you see, if one thing's certain, if one thing's clear, that while everything in this world is different and wrapped up, then we have the tendency and the ability to be able to spread His love through our simple actions and be able to make this happen for everybody. Because you see, we can all be set apart because we all are set apart. Go out and spread the gospel.